filming. So in today's video, we are going to show you how to teach your dog to speak. Chloe and Ted here from Everything Dogs with Chloe and on this channel I help you keep your hairy hound happy and healthy so if you're new here please think about subscribing because we also post videos on dog care, dog training and there's some great dog tricks that you can do with your dog also don't forget to check out all the links down below let's get into the video so what you want to do is you want to figure out how in what situation your dog might bark So there is the treat method So you hold a treat in front of them and because you're holding a treat in front of them Eventually they get so frustrated that they're gonna bark now unfortunately Ted res now unfortunately Ted respects what I've got in my hands so much that he will not bark what I have figured out is that with a toy, I have to do it with a toy for one because he's not treat orientated and also I have to put it to one side where he cannot get it because then he alerts me that he can't get it by barking. If I hold on to it, he'll just sit like he is now out of shot. Ted come here, Ted come, good boy. He'll just sit out shot, he might dance about a bit, he might lie down, but he's too respectful and won't do anything with it. We have tried to play with him, try and get him moving, try and go, well, hang on a minute, where's my ball? I want to play with my ball. But even then, he doesn't bark. He's not a dog who barks through play. So you have got to figure out what's the best way for you to get your dog to bark. So there's the treat method, and that's one method or there's the play method or there is the you put the toy on the side like I'm going to do now and get them to bark with the toy on the side so I'm not touching the toy yes good boy and he barks straight away because I'm not touching that toy because he respects if I touch it so I'm going to I'm going to put it, yes, good boy, put it to one side and then he barks instantly. So I'll put it to one side. Yes, now he is starting to make that ho, ho, ho sound. But I, now that he's beginning to get the bark, I want to reward him more with the bark. So I'll put it to one side and wait for him to bark rather than just make a yes, a little sound. Because that is what we're training them to do. So once your dog has started to bark continually, you want to put in the word speak and possibly a hand movement. So I'm going to use the word rather than the hand movement because that's what we're training at the moment. So I'm going to speak. Yes. So it's about timing. It doesn't always work out like that. But what you want to do is you want to say the word before they do it. So if they start to move their mouth, you know in a second they're going to bark. So I'm going to put the treat on the side, I'm going to say speak, speak, and speak, yes. <coughs> and as soon as he's spoken, I reward him. Speak, speak, yes, good boy. So a hand movement you can do that if you want to do a hand movement is that which is what I've used to do, but he responds really well to words. So he's not responding to that hand movement at the moment. So if I take this away, speak. So that's a very silent bark. So we don't want to reward that. Speak, yes. If they make a small bark, that is fine. But we don't want to reward a growl or a silent bark. Speak. Speak. Yes. So if they don't do it, if they don't make any sort of sound or movement at all, as soon as you've said speak, then don't reward them. Hold on for 10 seconds and then repeat. So it doesn't become speak, 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 I bark. It just speak, I bark. So what you'll want to do is over the next few days you want to keep doing this and keep training it. Don't ever stop because you don't want your dog to stop learning this new trick. So one more time, speak. So I'm waiting for 10 seconds now, or thereabouts. Speak. 
and I'm waiting again because I don't want him to associate speak, speak, speak with reward. Speak! Waiting again. Speak! Speak! Yes! And that is how it's done. So question of the day is, what else are you going to teach your dog in for their tricks? Let me know in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget if you are new here please think about subscribing and don't forget to check out all the links down below as well. And as always on here on Everything Dogs with Chloe we help you keep your hairy hound happy and healthy. Thanks for watching guys. Bye!